last week. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, Dak, congratulations on being the NFC Eastern Division champions. Yeah, appreciate that. Appreciate that. What's the significance of being able to take care of business today and not allowing this to go into week 17? Yeah, I mean, huge side? significance. Uh, I mean, obviously, we wanted to come out here and get things done, uh, and get things done under our, uh, under our will, I guess you can say, not necessarily – um, winning the division or clinching the division or, or playoff spot by, by other teams losing. So we wanted to come in and, and uh, make sure that, that we secured this thing. We got it done this week, and it was, it was a great team win. You got that first drive uh, early, and then you didn't get the ball till it seemed like about midway through the second quarter. What type of challenge did that present? Yeah, I mean, it was definitely a challenge. I mean, uh, but it's always great when the defense scores. Uh, so, I mean, acknowledging that, uh, great play by them, uh, Randy, and then obviously Jalen picking it back up, and then the team. Uh, the whole defensive unit doing a good job getting in the end zone. But uh, when you're sitting there on the sideline uh, wanting to get out there and, and you can't and you're, and you're on the – I mean, I guess – I mean, I don't know how many – how long it was in real minutes, but uh, it was a long time. And, and you're anxious. You're ready to get back out there. So um, it was a challenge. I mean, it was just a game of football, something that we had to deal with, uh, and we were able to do it. You enjoy this, or you say we got more work to do? Uh, we got a lot more work to do. Uh, this is just the start. This is the beginning. This is something that we set out – and wanted to do uh, way back in the off season, and this just gives us a chance to to go and get the greater goal. So, yeah. How do you think you guys did in the red zone today? I mean, obviously better than than, than we did last week, uh, and better than we have. So, I mean, um, we can start there. Uh, we can, but we can also get a lot better. We can turn some of those those couple of field goal drives right there into touchdowns. Um, we did a better job, better job executing. Uh, just some of them didn't work, and that, that's just how it goes. And you can, uh, you can grab your bags and go home with a good feeling, knowing that at least you, you gave it a good shot and wasn't missed execution, and nobody necessarily busted the player, did something like that. In the case we've been doing in the past, so it was just uh, good and clean. Um, but we can always execute and get more touchdowns. Well, talking about field goals, obviously, though, you always want to score a touchdown. Right. You guys have tremendous confidence in what Brett's doing. 62 yards against the Eagles, 59 today. Yeah, it gives you, yeah I mean, it gives you tons of confidence. I mean, right there, um, after a bad play by me, probably should have given the ball right there. Defense end made a great play, uh, pushing us back and, almost, and pretty much knocking us out of field goal range. And uh, being able to just get a couple of yards that third down uh, and then Brett coming in, just doing what he does and, and making, what, a 58-yarder uh, was huge. So, I mean, um, just got to give that guy a chance and get points on the board. And if we do that, uh, we give ourselves a chance. From three and five to where you all now clinching the playoff spot with a game to go, what does that say about your team? Uh, we knew it all along. Uh, you're probably the only ones in this room that counted us out. Um, so uh, at one and two, at three and three, at three and five, we knew exactly what we had. We knew the team that we had. Uh, and we still know that. Uh, and there's, there's a, as I said before, there's a lot of work to be done. Uh, and we, we're happy for tonight. We're going to celebrate it the right way, but then uh, get back, right back to work. Talk about the defensive performance tonight and, and the plays that Randy Gregory made and, and Jalen on that. Yeah, team. I mean, those guys show up week in and week out. I mean, they're huge players, and they make uh, great, great plays for the, for this team, impactful plays. Uh, as I said, Randy, Randy with the strip sack and then Jalen picking it up and all those other guys getting in front, doing exactly what, what their coaches do, blocking the speed and allow Jalen to run it into the goal line stance. Both those guys making plays. I mean, just the whole defense showing up tonight uh, has been huge, and they've been able to do that and uh, give us a chance week in and week out. I'm uh, thankful to, have, to be on their team, I guess you can say. How do you reconcile where you are as a unit right now offensively? Because like you say, you scored in the red zone and – they make a goal line stand, and you keep the ball for a while, but you're still not scoring the, the number of points you would like to score. Yeah, I mean, we won the game. Uh, and at the end of the day, as long as we win the game, we scored more points than they did. Um, that, that's all that matters. Uh, obviously, we have high expectations for ourselves, and when we don't score, um, I guess you can say we're angry or we're frustrated or whatever it is, but uh, we're, get, we're still getting three points at, at the same time, and we've got a great defense to go out there and back us up. So, I mean, our expectations are high, and we're going to get there, and we're going to get where we need to be, but it's going to take the work and continuing the work. As I said, we got a lot, a lot of work uh, still that we want, that we want to do. So I mean, we'll get it done. We'll how get better. Is, how important is it for you to One get time. Michael? How important is it for you to get Michael <coughs> Gale, Cole Beasley, some of these other guys you've got involved tonight? Uh, how important is it for the offense to get those other guys involved? Yeah, it's huge. I mean, especially obviously uh, clinching this playoff spot. That's what playoff football is. Is, is every guy being activated? Every guy doing? Uh, what, what he needs to do to contribute to the team win. Um, and it's not just necessarily counting on one guy um, every third down or being able to target him. Uh, you get into these playoffs and you get into to the better football, um, then the football that matters, they're going to key in. They're going to start double teaming and do things like that. So to get these other guys confidence, just get them activated, us getting on the same page uh, means a lot for this, this team and this offense. What's it like, Dak, on the, in the end zone over there? I mean, excuse me, in the sidelines, the goal line stance, and you see the defense – deny Jameis Winston at the one. What, what goes through your mind seeing all that happen? I mean, I never doubted that they would do that. Uh, I mean, 
give give the Bucks a lot of credit just for all the third down and fourth down conversions that they had tonight. But uh, when it really matters, our defense stands up, and, and as they did tonight. And uh, as I said, it's just great to be great to be on their side. In terms of the red zone, you know, you guys are obviously trying a lot of different stuff, and, and certainly tonight, are you happy that there's a bunch of different ways you can go? Not necessarily that you haven't executed maybe as well, but there's a lot of things you can do down there. Yeah, 100%. I think it's important, as, you, as you're saying, that, that we utilize all those different things to keep the defense um, keep the defense off guard and on their toes. Uh, and the simple fact, if we can hand it to a receiver, I can run it, give it to Zeke, we can throw the ball, uh, we, and we can get out of the pocket, make move, make uh, plays happen there. So, I mean, with all those options available to us, it's important that we utilize all of them. And I uh, saw a little bit of tonight, but we've got to just continue to keep getting better and uh, make those plays to get in the end zone. What are your thoughts when, when Ty goes down, he's the captain and a yeah. leader, and then after the game, how quickly do you guys start thinking about him? Yeah, I mean, uh, you never want to see that. As you said, a captain, a leader, a good friend, a brother. Um, it's a scary situation. Um, but, but obviously, they, they kind of gave us good news. He's moving everything um, at the beginning of the game or when it happened. They said everything was, was moving. So that's positive news there. Uh, you just tap him, you, know, you let him know you got, you got his back and uh, you're going to be thinking about him. Uh, and then, yeah, you celebrate this win and then Coach Gary gives us an update on him. So, I mean, uh, he's definitely um, – in our minds, in our hearts, uh, and in our prayers. Uh, and we, we just want to be there for him any way we can. Two years ago when you were a rookie, you got the division wrapped up. The starters didn't play at all in that final game. Jason said earlier in his press conference that the guys that were healthy and able to play would play. Does that mean a lot to you guys as starters to get to play rather than have to sit? Yeah, I mean, I want to play. And I think a lot of these guys in here want to play. As we've talked about things uh, that we need to get better on, that we need to improve. This is a good game for us to do it against a good team that's uh, been playing better football in the later part of the season. So uh, it's important for us to get there, uh, get in there, but at the same time, stay healthy, um, be able to just clean up things and just, uh, I guess you can say, iron out our the things that aren't so well uh, with our offense or just with our team, uh, just so we can continue this momentum going into the postseason. You talked about celebrating this, but coming off the field, it was a rather <laughs> subdued. Was it more of a, we took care of business, we expected to do this, we still have things to work on, or how would you characterize the overall? Yeah, you just said it right there. Uh, we expected to do this. We expected to win. Uh, we went in this game, had the right approach, and it was simple as that. Let's, let's take care of this game and, and what comes with it. We all know that and understand that. But at the same time, this just gives us a chance uh, for the greater goal, and we're excited for that. Appreciate it. Merry Thank Christmas. You. Merry Christmas.